I've been experiencing with Daddy. Life is getting frustrating. One day I settled on a thought to run away from home. I orchestrated a perfect plan, from one bus to another with the money I saved. I will stop the city or country where my money ends. I want to get as far away as possible. Daddy came home and corrected something I did that I shouldn't have done. I gave him the look of, but everyone is doing it, as if Daddy could read my mind. If everyone jumps into the fire, will you as well? Nobody is stupid enough to jump into the fire, I mumbled. The same way I thought no one would be stupid enough to disobey a teacher's instruction. I looked at him with a frowned face and walked out. Upon arriving at my room, I got the pouch that has my savings and walked out of the house. The wish to get away overtook me so much that I entered the first bus that stopped by the bus stop. The transit route took me through a tunnel train and three more bus rides. The heroic feeling sets in that I'm no longer under the bondage of that mean man. I started feeling hungry and stopped at the closest fast food place. Daddy told me before that there's a limit to the amount of food I could order at a fast food place. But now who could stop me? I requested item one and six with a big jar of drinks. This feels good because I'm free from the nag of, too much sugary drink is not good for you. Your total comp is to $30.56, the cashier said. Dad is paying, came out of my mouth without thinking about it. Cashier looks around and confused. That lady is your dad? The cashier pointed at a lady standing behind me in the queue. I looked around and, wait a minute, I thought. No, 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 I said in protest. Can you pay? Queue is getting bigger. The cashier pointed at a queue which had seven people waiting and more joined. I opened my pouch as three nickels and six dimes fall on the ground. This surprised me as I expected more in my pouch, so I searched the pouch for more cash, but it was empty. I tiptoed away, not bothering to pick up the fortune I just dropped on the ground. What do I do now? 